What's good, CBT fam? Before y'all get into the video, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell to get notified every time I upload content. Peace. What up, YouTube? It is your boy, Big Cool, coming to you from Colossal Boxing Talk. Colossal Boxing Talk is associated with Three Kings Boxing under the movement umbrella, and I am back with another video. Jeff Horn is talking cash money shit towards Terrence Bud Crawford. He said he hopes Crawford doesn't get scared and postpone the fight again. As you all know, these two guys were supposed to fight April 14th um, in Las Vegas. But Terrence Crawford sustained an injury to his uh, left hand, I believe, and had to postpone the fight, which is rescheduled for June 9th. Um, that's going to take place on the ESPN Plus app. I'm pretty sure it's going to take place on ESPN as well. Um, but the fight is in Las Vegas and this is a huge, huge, um, fight for both guys. This will be Jeff Horn's first title offense after he defeated future Hall of Famer, a division world champion, Manny Pac-Man Pacquiao last July in Brisbane, Australia. Now he has, in my opinion, um, the top pound for pound guy that's going to be standing across from him come June 9th. Former undisputed junior welterweight champion Terrence Bud Crawford, who is the overwhelmingly favorite going into this fight, and why wouldn't he be? He's undefeated. Like I said, he's former undisputed junior welterweight champion. He can fight out of both orthodox and the southpaw stance. He has power. He can box. He's a dog. I mean, he's just supremely skilled. But he's going up against a rugged, rough, and strong. Um, occasionally dirty fighter and Jeff Horn, who is a big boy. He's real big. Uh, he was able to manhandle uh, Manny Pacquiao uh, a lot in their fight, although Pacquiao was able to hurt him. But Jeff Horn isn't anything special. Um, he's a solid fighter. You know, uh, he's not overly strong. He's not fast. Uh, he's just a, a, a tough guy that can fight on the inside, that likes to make it an ugly you know, um, fight, get his opponent out of, um, you know, out of his game plan and kind of just, you know, wear him down with his physical size and strength. He's more of a physically strong guy than he is a strong puncher. And it's going to be uh, interesting to see how Bud deals with that. But this is what uh, Jeff Horn had to say. I don't know why they postponed last time, but whatever happens, happens. I've had friends tracking him on Instagram and Facebook and whatever. He seemed to be bowling and using that that uh, hand quite fine for a guy with a hand injury. So he's definitely skeptical of um, the reason, the real reason why the fight was postponed in the first place. But neither that's neither here nor there. It is May 4th. The fight is taking place a little over a month in June 9th. And that's where these guys are going to have to do that talking with their fists. I believe that Terrence Bud Crawford is going to beat that ass like a, lo a lot of other people. The only people I believe that's rooting for um, Jeff Hornet actually believes he's going to win is his home country people in Australia. Other than that, I don't see anybody picking him for any other legit reason other than they rooting for the underdog or maybe they dislike Terrence Crawford. But, and this is a big but. If um, Jeff Horn is able to pull off this, this will be a major, major upset, and it will just turn the welterweight division upside down, you know, in a huge and shocking way. But I like to hear that confidence from Jeff Horn, who is um, supremely confident, believes he's going to win, he's going to do the job against Terrence Crawford. He also believes that Terrence Crawford is scared. I don't know if he genuinely believes that or he's just doing the, you know, the pre-fight trash talk to try to drum up interest in this fight that really hasn't had a lot of buzz. So, with Jeff Horn talking cash shit and Terrence Crawford talking cash um, cash money shit, hopefully that trash talk turns into one hell of a fight come June 9th, a fight of the year type fight. But we shall see come June 9th. If you like this video, go ahead and do what I told you to do in the beginning. Drop a comment in the comment section below. Head over to Facebook. Find the Colossal Boxing Talk Facebook page. Like that um, page. Head over to Twitter. Follow me on Twitter at ColossalCBT. Shout out to everybody in the movement that's moving with us. Also, be sure to subscribe to 3kingsboxing.com daily for your latest and greatest unfiltered and unbiased boxing news. Also, shout out to my boy CJ from the Boxing Clinic. That's my dog. 
Um, we started this uh, years ago, you know what I'm saying? And he's doing big things on over there on his channel. So make sure you go check him out and hit that subscribe button. But until next time, I'm out. Peace.